What's up, Dean TV, Dean HD family? Today, we're doing a story time. Today's story time is going to be about first time. Hmm. I almost got evicted. Well, we almost got evicted. Well, this is probably my first time, Um, I can say, freaking having a place, Uh, I guess you say, by myself, I guess you can say. But I actually had, like, roommates, you can say, though, at the but my roommates was my cousin and her sister. You feel me? Yeah. Boom. Dean family. Yeah. This shit gonna be interesting, wild, crazy. Yeah. It's gonna be wild, to be honest. But yeah. Yeah. Dean family. Yeah. 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 Like, boom. Boom. Remind you when I was telling you, like, last story time, I was telling you about first time getting drunk as fuck. Yeah. This around this time span, right? Boom. And like, mind you, I was still working at Walmart. And like, during that time, they weren't really paying for real, for real like that. And yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, my job was to like, pay someone. Like, we had a like, uh, how can I say? Uh, schedule. Schedule. A plan, a routine, a route, whatever you want to say. Like, people had no different stuff in the house, bills, and et cetera, you feel me? Like, me and my cousins, and we, we, all three of us, we, for the rent, we, we like, you, like, split it down so, like, everybody can afford it and pay for it, you feel me? Then, like, for the, like, the, uh, light bill, that was my job for the light bill, you feel me? But, like, the water was, like, for my cousin to do, and, yeah, yeah, and, like, Boom, my cousin, my cousin's sister, she had one of the easiest jobs to be honest, I think. She had to keep shit stacked, stopped, and like pay half, and like, that's about it, to be honest. And like, yeah, then family, it's like, she started getting, she had got a boyfriend, right? She got a boyfriend. Did, he wasn't, like, I can honestly say he ain't, he wasn't shit because, bruh. She when she when she wasn't with him, she was doing good. She was focused. You feel me? She was doing right. She got with him. She started fucking. She started fucking all fucking up. Like bro, like tee up. Like what are you doing? It's like bro. It's like she started slacking off. Then it's like she she had quit her job because of him. Because he she he he was basically want to control her. Like basically more to the story and like miss having her do stuff. And having her pay out the pocket for stuff and having her spend money that she don't need to be spending, you feel me? And it's like, you doing all this for him, but he ain't doing nothing for you. When I say nothing, nothing. Like, literally nothing. Like, bro used to be, what well, we used to want to be a wannabe trapper for real, for real. Like, it's wild. Like, you spend you spend weeks and months and you barely coming coming on with shit like what the fuck? Then she find this dude cheating, take him back, she cheat on her again, take him back, then get pregnant from a nigga. Then guess what happened when this time? That's what happened when this shit happened. It's like bro, she dipped out on us and like bro, we was devastated because we didn't know what the fuck we was gonna do because yeah, we didn't have. That amount at the time, and it's like, bro, we had to do extra stuff. They had to uh fill in for stuff that she was she wasn't doing and get stuff that she wasn't doing. Like, bro, it was extra. It was stressful as shit to be honest. Cause it was like, dang, what we can do? And yeah, that's what I did. Dean family, like in high school, I was a sneakerhead. More to the story, and like I used to connect sneakers, and like I had to sell some of my shits for real. It's crazy and sad, and I actually miss them shoes till this day. Till this day, you feel me? So, I feel like in the future, I may get them same shoes that I sold for, like, yeah, I had to sell that shit, for real. It's crazy. And I had to sell my freaking Xbox 360. It was a white version. But, yeah, I had a PlayStation 3 also, so I wasn't sweating. I had a PlayStation game, you feel me? Yeah. And it's crazy. It's like wow. Because one of my friend my friend cousin 
baby mama, friend, well, my my cousin, baby, my cousin, baby mama, friend was like, yeah, this is around the time when um I think what's that shit called Craigslist was like still like popping or what the fuck ever and like all this other shit, yeah, yeah, and it's I think. I don't think only for fans or nothing like that was existed or was a thing back then. So yeah, Dean family, yeah. She was like, "Hey, you know what y'all should do? You should, uh, you should, uh, uh, what you call it? You should fuck for a buck." I'm like, "What?" You said, "Fuck for a buck." You said, "Yeah." You said, "You look good, and I'm pretty sure if you got good game in the bed, it's gonna be affordable. It's gonna be." You gonna get paid, paid for real. It's like it's gonna be your price. It was like, oh, like, oh shit. I was, I'm like, that's kind of clutch, to be honest. I'm like, no. Nah. I, I said, no. Nah, I ain't gonna do that shit. What the fuck? Because, like I told y'all, I had wanted to be the female Tiana Trump. So it's like, why would I do that when I could be make when I could do that and make more? You feel me? Like, what? Huh? Hell no. Nah. Hell fucking. And also around this time, like, I had to start working my ass off. And, like, I got sick, to be honest. Like, I started working so much because I didn't get no days off when doing this time span when I was working. It was like I had to work, like, three or four or five months straight without no off days. And, like, eventually that shit caught up to me. Then I got kind of sick. I guess I could say sick. Basically, I fainted, passed out. I don't know the fuck. They had, they had me hooked up to the IV, and yeah, I was, like, I was I was out of there. You feel me? I ain't know what happened, but more to the story. Doctor told me get some rest, relax, and chill. You feel me? Because I got a lot going on, a lot of stress, and like it was overwhelming me, and I had a lot of like death and stuff that was going on at that time. Also. And like it said, all them, all that was going on, and like affected me, and like that's the reason that happened. You feel me? So like I uh, learned from that and learned not to overwork myself. You feel me? Because yeah, you don't want to do that, like burn out. You feel me? But but I'm thankful because. Our parents came in the clutch. To be honest, I'm just I'm just keep it short and simple. Our parents came in the clutch. To be honest, I said, oh y'all, we got y'all. You feel me? Like they both gave us like loaned us something, and we had to pay them back or whatever. You feel me? Like yeah, it was clutch as fuck. You feel me? And, like literally, literally the real freaking MVP. Yeah, feel me? And it's like it's amazing. Because I had to be the one that holds shit together. Make sure people were like, yeah, head focused, head straight. And like, make sure it was good vibes, you feel me? And like, because people be, people, you know, will do some reckless, get upset, and et cetera, et cetera, and go wild when shit like that finna happen. But yeah, glad we persevered and made it through that, to be honest. Because yeah, that shit was wild. That shit was wild thinking about that. It's like she dipped out on us. She did a whole race. She did a NASCAR three hundred on her ass, like literally. And like the rent people was like, "Oh y'all barely made it. Y'all barely made it." I'm like, "Yeah, you right about that." But we made it though. We made it. I'm like, yeah. But you got late fees. I'm like, yeah, yeah. He said, can we pay that to for like next month? He said, cool. Yeah, he let us do that. That was clutch also because like, you didn't even have to do that. You feel me? He could say, oh, fuck y'all. I got some couple to do cut through. I'm going to do some grim ass shit to y'all. And I'm just glad he didn't. And I'm just glad. <sighs> shit. If you got parents or somebody that's coming to clutch for you like that, like I just said. Like this video, give a thumbs up and share this with they uh clutch ass. You feel me? Like I love you. Thank you. Like you got a cousin, a brother, a sibling, or a friend. You feel me? Like that to come in the clutch for you, man. Share this with they ass because y'all clutch. Y'all clutch. Like y'all don't know how uh how superheroistical 
y'all is for real, for real, like, like, y'all need a fucking award, simple, hope you guys like this and enjoy it, see you next time, I'm out, check out the merch, in the description box, I'm gonna go copy something, you feel me, cause we just dropped some new shit for the summer.